Welcome back to Metro Exodus. In the last episode, we took the van and drove all the way back to the train for the first time in forever to uh, deliver the maps that we got from the communication center. We did that, a whole dust storm happened, and they kind of, since we've left, they've set up some base of operations here, so now I can actually switch out with fresh weapons and use a workbench and kind of do pretty much all the usual stuff here. But everybody's in a bad way. Um, next immediate thing to do, main quest wise, is to get water. People are actually, some of our people are down, just, they took, they just can't do anything because they're so dehydrated. So we desperately need water. And in the longer term, we need to figure out exactly where we're going to go, and we need gasoline, and probably have to deal with the Baron and all that stuff. Uh, but for now, water for the main quest. I want to go around the train a little bit more, see if I can talk to a few people and check out a few things, and then after that, I think I'm going to head to those question marks over there to the east. But first, can I speak with you? Что, Артём, неважно у нас положение, а? Скажи. Придачу у нас тут и гости были. Но мы их по первому чину приняли, дело ясно. Они как набежали. Степан как раз со своими сорубкой на посту стоял, ну и покрошил всех. Мы выскочили, а тут уже одни клочки по закоулочкам. И Степан лежит. Я думал, загрызли гад, а нет, целый. Но жар у него и бредит. Тепловой удар, вот. Ну, снесли его на станцию, лежит пластом. Остальные хлопцы тоже еле ходят, так что если нефтяники местные серьезно навалятся, можем и не сдюжить. А навалиться-то они как раз могут, потому что сдается мне, Гюль в темную нас разыграть хочет. Столкнуть нас с ними лбами, как тех баранов. И это ей был бы куда как на руку. Да толку с того, если мы все тут без воды ослабнем, и они нас тепленькими возьмут. Вот. Полковник воду одним больным до да часовым выдавать наказал, а сам-то не пьет совсем. Фу, сидит теперь, как тот сыч, и не вытащишь его. Говорит, больно плох. А через то боевому духу большой вред может быть. Ну а какой там вред, когда и так уже и некуда, без воды-то? Ермак она. А ж вот с воздуха ее добывать задумал. А какая там вода? Самый пекло же. Yeah, I remember your mock talking about that. Вот такие дела. Без воды до горючки сам, понимаешь, нам край. И надо нам их до черта и поболе. Ведь Аврора одной воды за час, то он и две на пар перевой. До горючки на дым тоже, он будь здоров. Так что мы тут как есть на мели. Надо с нее сыматься, двигать отсюда, а то грабанемся все. Такие, братка, пироги с котятами. This thing goes through two tons of water per hour? Holy shit. How big is this water tank? And uh, where is the place? Oh, that's where we need to go for the, the main quest. All the way up north. That's where the source of water is. There's like a well over there? Apparently? I mean, I went over there. I don't remember a well offhand, but I'm not sure. Maybe they mean... Is it that little valley place? Where, like, a lot of people stayed and... I'm not sure. We'll see when we get there. Anyway, I wanted to check out this up here, because I don't think I've been here before. Yeah, I didn't really explore this area around the train very much. Don't think it's going to run. Like, this up here isn't even really on the map. Guess it's just a lookout. There is one question mark over here, actually, even though I thought I explored all this over here. Is that... One, like, directly ahead. Let me go grab the van. Всем слушать! Барон говорит будет! Всем слушать! Барон говорит! Пацаны! Что с авиабазой? Прослаживание из дома родов 
сплотилась тьма. Я тебе когда сказал, что там зачистник, а барахло цены и особенно пушки, что брать и сюда привезти. Какого хера куча хорошего железа пропадает? Пацаны его там рассаскивают, да друг другу морды бьют, и не смотрит даже, что ты там смотрящим на сзади. Людей нет, зашиваешь ты, не справляешься. Так ты прямо так и скажи. А если подписался, так давай предоставь. А то не ясно, ты за кого меня вообще держишь. Всем отбой, барон сказал. There's actually some valuable information in that. Um, so Anna, if you remember, I think it was in the last episode, Anna was pointing out a bunch of stuff that, that she had seen from her vantage point. Ooh. Just move out of the way of this little thing. There you go. Be on your way. Don't piss off the snake. They actually might be about to collide. No. Narrowly avoided it. Um... Yeah, Anna pointed out uh, an airfield, like a air traffic control tower looking thing, which I think is literally an air traffic control tower, given that the Baron just talked about an airfield calling it freaks and like, why haven't you cleared it out? There's good equipment in there. Uh, in other words, hint, hint, I should go there. There's good stuff. Oh yeah, and I got this new shotgun. Oh, it's got to be this nest. That's got to be what's on the map. Some bodies around here. I assume. Yeah, I'm not expecting to find anything exciting. Yeah, let's go. So, let's go east. I'm not going to cut this driving out because I don't drive this thing all that often and it's really, really cool. Can we, like, attach some train wheels to this thing and, like, tow it behind us? Make it an extra carriage? I know it doesn't really make any sense at all, but I like it. I don't think it's even really faster than just sprinting with your gun down. And I don't care. First stop. Something over here, and I hear screaming in the distance. Oh! <laughs> Fuck! There's so many of them! Wow, they really caught up on me. Like I heard some screaming in the distance. I thought they were, I thought they were way ahead of me, but they came out of holes behind me. Tricky little bastards. Okay, now I know they're there. I'm not sure if this is working any better, really. Oh! Well, that just really sealed the deal. 
I was just in the process of stabbing myself with a, a what do you call those little things? Serret, I think. And then I got killed by a demon, I think. They must have heard the car or something, right? Because they're like coming from all over. Like one came from over here. Oh, that's them. Let's try to get it under something. Well, that didn't work very well. They got you out in the open. They're scary. Fuck off. The shotgun's amazing. I love it. Just the one body? I feel like there's gotta be more. Hmm. Oh, just a little bad buddy. Look at this question mark directly ahead. I think we're getting into the place where things are occupied. Actually, you know what? Yeah, like, I think this might be occupied over here. Like, I think there's a scout up in the crane that's a little bit ahead, and then the boat over that way where I'm pointing on the map, I think is where they hold prisoners. Before doing any of that, let's go to the airfield, because there's supposedly good stuff there. Maybe there's, like, a new weapon or something. Really good upgrades. Let's take our van. Let's do a little off-roading. I'm going to follow the black line, which is the train track. Yeah, there's a question mark along the black line, and then a little bit after that we should be to the airfield. How does this thing... How, oh, how does this thing fare on the tracks directly? Not bad, actually.
Oh shit. Oh, 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 we got thugs. And they know I'm here. They certainly do. Hmm, I don't have any 4x scope or anything like that. This is the best I got. I'm actually hitting people? Kinda. Took one out. I should probably just drive in there, huh? Fuck it. What are you doing? Get out! Oh god, no, 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 not out of this door! Fuck. I guess it was blocked by, like, the hill or something? We tracked some monsters? Oh, yes, we did. Throw knives at them or try to run them over? Run them over. Windshield wipers work. I've tried pressing G, by the way, see if I can wipe the windshield with the windshield wipers, but I don't think this thing has any. Well, that worked pretty well. Could have been all of them, though. There were definitely more, but I guess they ran away. Yeah, these were thugs, right? Yeah. There's another one that I killed from afar. I think they were back here. Oh, I killed two from afar, I think. I like that you find some containers that are just opened. Showing you... Like, it just kind of makes the world feel like, hey, you know... There's a lot of boxes of supplies around, but a lot of them were just used. Not every single box is, like, for you and is lootable. People need these things. People use these things all the time. Okay, let's go on foot from here. Where's the tower? Oh, there's a demon there. Yeah, I think a demon has a nest in there. I thought I had spotted everything. Let's try to find a back entrance.
How am I doing on ammo? Got a couple magazines for the assault rifle, a couple magazines for the shotgun. Not bad, not great. Oh, look at that. Look at that setting sun. They spot me? Uh, I th think they just spotted me. Let's try to get indoors. Yeah, this'll do. I guess. <laughs> now this is seriously giving me stalker vibes. I remember finding downed attack helicopters. And stalker, and swamps, and stuff like that. I remember finding an attack helicopter, or maybe it was not an attack helicopter, but just a normal helicopter, in Darkwood. I remember that was a huge thing. It really stood out. Should I just ignore them and get indoors? There is a lot of them around. Of course, this is the only one that's actually aggroed at me. I want to check out this whole place. There's so many vehicles to check out. Yeah, I'm going to take it out. Okay. Let's try this thing. I haven't used it for a while. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Alive? Holy shit, I thought that killed me. There goes almost all my shotgun ammo. I've got three shots of it left. Should not make a habit of killing demons. What the hell is that? It's like a spray of a skull that's meant to go on a wall, but it's not... It shouldn't be there. It doesn't fit there. What the hell? Slave. Ooh, what are those attachments? Something new there. It's for the A shot, though. Well, I think some attachments can be used for multiple weapons, though. a trail of blood. Hmm. 
there's a bunch of bones and more bodies. Is this a lair? Found some more shotgun rounds. Oh, hi. It is a lair. It's a trap. Shit, I don't think I have any more ammo left of this thing. What the hell is going on out there? I should maybe intervene? I'm not doing so hot myself, but... Took all my knives back? Yes, I did. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Wait a minute. Now let's get the hell out of here. Well, guess I just gotta shoot him then. Oh, Jesus. You fucker. Alright, why don't you come to me then? Let's make it make it real fast. Two, actually. These were the Baron's people, huh? I thought I saw the names, uh, the name tags say tribal, though. Was, was there a, were they shooting at a tribal somewhere? What is going on with that door? Were they shooting at one of the slaves? Is that what they mean when they say tribal? Does that mean slave, or what, what group of people is that? Even if I don't find any loot, I just love looking at these half-buried, dusty old tractors and stuff.
Hands tied behind their back. They were killed there. Not a suicide. What does that say? I don't know. I don't know if it's Russian or not. It's cursive, so even if... Whether it's Russian or not, I can't read it. It starts with an R. I can tell you that. I think. We've got a bunch of attachments. Let's check them out. Do I have any new ones for these weapons? Oh, yeah. For everything, actually. Uh, for my assault rifle, I have a green laser. High visibility laser sight reassembled in a custom-made body along with a bunch of modifications. Increases accuracy slightly. And I guess it's easier to see. Cool. For the shotgun. Short barrel and suppressor. Barrel with an improvised suppressor mounted on it. Useful for stealth. And completely caked in mud. It reduces damage by one, increases accuracy by one, and reduces stability by one. Not that big of an effect overall. Do I want it, though? Like, do I want it? I don't... It sounds so damn good without a suppressor is the thing. <laughs> I'll try it out, though. And for the T-car, it's probably the green laser that was new, because now it's not here anymore. Just got the infrared laser. Let's go back to the red laser. Don't need a night vision scope. That's all good. Damn, it is high vis visibility. That looks really good. It's very easy to see. It goes really far, too. Like the red one. The red laser sometimes disappears at a certain distance. Yeah, this one. Holy crap. I can see it all the way over there. All the way up in the tower. Hmm, so this thing's pressure system that passively recharges it slowly. It only recharges it up to the top of green, so it won't, like, overcharge it, quote-unquote. So it isn't actually making it go to max damage. Worth keeping in mind. I don't like it when the light flickers like that. Oh, oh pff, fucking spiders. Oh, oh, I see you. I see you. I just missed four out of five knives. That's some extraordinary. This thing's quiet suppressed. Like, wow. Also does seem significantly more accurate. Those are really tightly grouped shots. One shot of it left now. Yeah, fuck trying to use knives. My god. Unless it's just a really comfortable position where I'm a good distance away from him. Like, it's so easy to miss. Speaking of which, I'm missing three of my knives. How did I lose three of my knives? Shouldn't they be like right in here? There's one of them beneath something. It was basically invisible. Ah, whatever. Good enough, I guess. Oh, I see, you little fucker.
can't get a headshot from here. Just woke up, up upstairs. I was wondering if I could get upstairs. I guess the answer is yes, if there's monsters up there. Ooh, that actually charges pretty fast. Let's pick some more balls for this thing. pressure system that pressurizes it automatically doesn't include the thing that keeps it pressurized, but like keeps it over pressurized without losing pressure. Nope. Bad time to reload. Didn't mean to shoot. That was an accident. The Baron was not kidding when they said this place was crawling with monsters. Holy shit. What an ammo sink. What a nightmare. Used to practically all my ammo. Also, these guns sound amazing. Like, especially this one indoors, hip firing with it. Awesome. Um. Yeah, the suppressed shotgun. I kind of want to undo it because it sounds so weak. But it is more accurate. I'll leave it. <sighs> okay, room by room. Ooh. I think that includes something new. Some sort of a new stock. This thing? Wait, did I have... Why the hell did I have the light grip on? What the hell? I must have accidentally not installed the better one. Sometimes I forget to double click to install. Like, this does not change and I have to double click to actually do it. Holy shit. No wonder my stability was so garbage. Hip firing and my... Weapon shooting all over the place. What's well, more than double my stability with this thing? Wow. Whoops. amount of ammo. And you look like you were armed to the teeth. Oh, 
Oh wow, we can even go up more and more and more. Right, well this place is a labyrinth. Have I been everywhere? It's hard to tell. I guess so. Guess I just need to go up here now. I think I've roughly woken up every monster in the entire building at this point. I hope. Nope. It's gotta be where the good stuff is. Somebody living here? Oh, it's a place where I can live. Somebody was living here. Look at how shot up this place is. A couple dozen bullet holes around here. Oh, shit. I didn't mean to do that. I didn't know you could burn flags. You can burn flags? So I can burn all the Baron's flags? Oh, I just lit that on fire. Damn. This lighter is amazing. Whoa, what is that? I think it's an upgraded binocular. Two new attachments. Check out the attachments. Night vision device amplifier. This night vision system combines two technologies, heat vision and visible light amplification. Such systems were only available to special forces before the war. Oh, it's night vision, not binoculars. Heat vision. Let's try that. That sounds super cool. Okay, so this doesn't look any different, but maybe if there's an actual warm entity around, it will become more obvious. Let's just leave it for now. I will not cut them some slack. Fuck off.
Hmm. Think I can walk on that little rim? Oh, heck yeah. Think there's a reward for doing this? Oh, heck no. Hmm. Let's try that again. Let's maybe not sprint this time. Yeah, there's, <laughs> there's no advantage to doing that. But it was fun. I want to check out that crashed helicopter down there. Oh yeah, there was something else I was going to check out. We got some new attachments, didn't we? New ones for the Shambler. Long Barrel. Long Barrel provides a considerable damage boost along with a small increase in accuracy at the expense of handling convenience. So compared to the Short Barrel, two more damage, one more accuracy, and wow, actually way less stability. Hmm. I'll try it out. Don't really need to clean any of my weapons, I suppose. They're doing pretty good. They look shitty, but they're at like 75% or more. I think that's it for up, oh, up here. I should not jump down there. That will kill me. Oh no, oh no. Oh, Jesus. There we go. Oh, I think this is a spot you can't get to normally. There actually might be something here. Secrets? Be something good in here, right? Something stored in here? A postcard? They even give you a way out. Like, they know you're gonna come here. They give you this as, like, a little pathway. Can I crawl through that hole? <laughs> Is there something on the other side? <laughs> okay, then. Oh, God. Uh, I think we're fine falling. Okay, hurt a little bit. Yeah, alright, well, there's all for that building. We looked at that building, but there's gotta be some other stuff here. There has to be. This place is too big for there to be literally nothing else. At least a couple bodies or something. Oh, shit. Hey, good test of the night vision, huh? No, not that. That doesn't seem to be doing anything. Or it only works from close range? Maybe it only works on humans? I don't see why that'd be the case, though. I'm pretty sure those are warm-blooded. Oh, well. Well, let's go with night vision for now, because I don't want the thing to see me. Oh yeah, there's a zip line from up there. Goes down there, and... That tower. That might be the only way to the tower, actually. If it is, then I'll have to go there, because there's got to be something good up there.
Nope, there's a letter. There's probably nothing in that tangle of a hanger. There's nothing in the other one either. Wait, never mind. I think there might be a body. Imagine this game's gorgeous. Okay, well, I think we're done with the air traffic control place. So I think I'll end this episode here. I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, we got a bunch of other question marks to check out around here.